Save the host! And by the time this is sun done, you'll know exactly what that means. This is actually the second skill in our journey towards mastering subnetting. Now, these skills are designed to be independent, but I will say if you take the subnetting based on network requirements before you get here, it will just come a lot easier. It's, it's a very similar process, and I'm not gonna go as deep into it as I did when I went through the initial subnetting skill. So if you haven't done that yet, dive into that, and then jump into here as we twist the story a little bit to build networks based on how many hosts per network we have.